so that's why uh, very often it's translated as plan that they plan and Allah plans and Allah is the best of planners and even the, uh, they say that scholars say that even life you should plan but don't over plan because Allah plans right so yeah we, we have an idea of okay I want to be here or go this direction but if Allah then steers you uh, away from that then don't um, become overly like um, you know anxious about it almost as if as if Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala you know is, is gearing you or steering you towards a certain way I remember one particular uh, very influential person in this in, in our history um, who at one point a young man um, he had applied for a job and didn't get it and he must have been devastated because he worked very hard didn't get this job but that then led him to go off and do a PhD which then led him to become a great influential thinker. So had he got the job, he probably wouldn't have done the PhD. So again, you know, we plan, but Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala plans, okay? So we go with Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala's plan. Uh, so we don't do nothing, like I'm just going to leave it complete to God. And we don't just completely over plan, but we, we, we plan and then you just go with the flow, right? You just go with the flow wherever, wherever Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, whatever direction he's taking you.